Yo, back again with another reaction. Um, welcome to Weekend Shift Channel. Go by the name of Wah Hotel. Um, yeah, we're going to be doing a reaction. Um, we love what the cut is doing, obviously. Um, so I'm just going to be doing another video of theirs and then reacting to what the people are saying and stuff, you know, and enjoy myself. So shout out to them. This one is called I'm Looking for Casual D. I don't know what casual D is, but we'll hear as as the show goes on. <laughs> you know damn right I know what casual D is. Come on, bro. Let's go. That's so, what brought you here? Casual D. Ooh. Really? Welcome okay. to The Button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for- I've never met a girl, by the way, that's just like, yo, I'm looking for casual D. Never met a girl. I wish I had made her when I was single though. Would have made things more lively. For a new person. Get out of here. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, they win an all expenses paid second date. This is the button. Hi, how are Hi you? Josh. Katie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh it's God. probably not as fun though, must, I must say. Like I was just thinking in my head, but I wasn't saying it. I was thinking a lot about how casual D. Although you can meet like an amazing girl and like have casual D, but it won't be as great as like true intimacy, you know, like really being in a relationship and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, because sex is amazing, but like without the intimacy and like the chats and whatnot, it's not that great, you know. And I'm not trying to be that guy, you know what I mean? Because everybody loves sex, but it's great for a short while, man, is what I'm trying to say. Your hands are really cold. Mine are very warm. A little anxious. Sorry. <laughs> honestly. Hi, Button. Josh likes yeah. to play Super Smash Bros. competitively. Competitively? Well, I, I do play it competitively. <laughs> like yeah. in tournaments and stuff? Mm hmm. Wow. Yeah, I've traveled around. I've been ranked like in the state before. Oh, cool. So. I have a pretty bad relationship with like gamers. <laughs> oh, really? What yeah. happened? <laughs> My ex boyfriend pretty much prioritized PC gaming. Like, oh. Okay. And it just like really took away from our relationship, and I'm just I like, see. yeah. <laughs> okay. Why did you press me? Oh my goodness! Why did That's I press okay. you? Tell me. Well, she's anti-gamer. <laughs> okay. <and> I, <laughs> so I say anti. It's just not my thing, and I've had that. a bad history with it, so I stay away from it. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. yeah. Sorry, no, no, you're okay. <laughs> She's such a sweet girl, though, man. She's so sweet, though. You know what I mean? Like, I love women like that, where it's, like, the very, like, nice and sweet and just, like, homely type of vibe, you know? She's so sweet, man. You should have given her a chance, bro. Come on. Hi. Josh. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? All these girls thick. You have really good eye contact. Chubby girls. I appreciate oh, chubby that. Chubby girls. Shout You're out welcome. To <laughs> Thank you. Ah, thank you. <laughs> so, do you have any tattoos? No. Do you want any tattoos? I don't have an urge. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, that's okay. I don't know. I just didn't like feel a spark mm. or like a vibe. That's fair. That's yeah. fair. All right. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. Hi, I'm Morgan. I'm David. David, nice, nice to, to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, so what, what about you here? I'm just looking to find someone to hang out with, maybe fall in love with. Okay, okay, You know? Okay. Are you family oriented then? Oh, 100 He's fucking handsome. Don't tell me, don't, don't, don't even fucking, don't even go there. Don't, don't fucking go there. But he looks fucking amazing. And she looks amazing too. So somehow I feel like, oh, that's a good connection right there, bro. Ooh, okay, cool. He's got that fuckboy look. He's got that fuckboy look. Definitely. He's got that fuckboy look. No homo. I don't know why I feel like I have to say that. Because, like, I'm very secure in my sexuality. But at the same time, yeah, no homo. How long ago was your last relationship? My last one was probably, like, <laughs> my freshman year of college. We vibed out for, like, a whole summer. And then uh, just came to a point where I watched myself do way more than I should have. Yeah. And I seen that with my own mom, so I was like, nah, I gotta, yeah. I gotta chill off that. And since then, kind of sucks. I ain't, I ain't find that spark since. Okay. Why don't you two play a short game of truth or dare? Uh oh. Oh. Okay, yeah. truth or dare. Let's go dare. Let's don't have do some that. fun. Dare. Don't do that. Don't do that. I dare you two to kiss. Oh, that's, that's cool. wild. That, that is crazy. Yeah, that's out of my comfort zone. I'm not okay. even gonna lie. She wanted to, she wanted to do it. She wanted to do it. She was ready. 
Ooh, fuck. Come on, bro. Just fucking kiss her, bro. She's cute too, man. Fuck. She wanted to do it, bro. Fuck. So sad now, but like, come on, bro. Just kiss the lovely lady. Uh, don't be mad. I'm not going to be mad. Be All fucking right. mad, it's bro. It's okay. Uh, but I do. I like the vibe. Yeah. Is. Fucking like asshole. Cool. You know what it is? Yeah. Fucking the asshole. The standard is kind of crazy now. Yeah. It's it was surprise. really nice to meet you. Of course. Uh, his Nobody dick. warns you about that. That's not easy. What? Why did you buzz her up? There was a spark, but it wasn't like, it didn't make me go wild. David. I'm Eden. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What do you like to do? I like to party. <laughs> I like to party. I like to party. That Con me. Man. That's your vibe? Con me. Yeah. How old are you? I'm 21. Ah, Wait. okay. I'm 25. Nice. Okay. No! I'm not gonna... Don't the, the do age, it! The age, the age. Yeah. I'm sorry. I thought so. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> don't feel good. Was it just her age? Yeah, that and the party thing was just like, I've done that already. I'm David. Jennifer. Nice. Do I feel, I, I feel sort of offended because I'm close to hitting 30. You can tell by my bold head and shit. Um, and I'm still out here. Wait, what the fuck? She's got a nice, like crazy. Anyway, let me stay focused, stay focused. Um, how does I saying? Fuck, I forgot what I was saying. What was I saying? Fuck, the ass was... <laughs> She distracted me. Okay, what are you two cool. looking for in relationship wise? <laughs> I wanted to start as a friendship and then just so kind of like vibe uh, it out in a relationship. Me. Jenny also said she's looking for casual dick. Oh, I said that? Oh my god. That's what you're looking for, huh? That's crazy. That was in the bio. I don't remember saying that well. So you're just looking for something casual right now? You beat me to it, okay. Fair enough. Well, it was wonderful. It was wonderful meeting yeah, you. You're cute, though. Thank you. I appreciate it. Is that really what you're looking for, though? Yeah, I think I am. <laughs> I'm Nathan. Jennifer. She knows damn right she's looking for that I'm type just of vibe right now. So I'm looking. Don't be shy. For casual dick. Okay. <laughs> So like we don't know at this point. We all know you're looking for casual. Would you be? Would you be? Own okay that with shit. That? Own that shit, bro. Nathan, how casual are you with your dick? <laughs> Decent. <laughs> Decent. That's funny. That's funny. That's funny. How Not casual sure. were you last month? That's funny. Ooh. A couple times. <gasps> I didn't even get that. What did he say? <laughs> Ouch. Sorry. He smashed my finger. Nathan, I think you're eliminated. I am. So, what brought you here? Casual dick. Really? Yes. Well, I'm like, is that... Okay, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> is that just actually, like, what you're looking for here? I don't, I don't think she's into him and she doesn't want guys. She doesn't like guys like that. Um, mainly because, you know, women one stereotypical type of guys and stuff like that. But if she gives him a chance, somehow I feel like they might be good together. They might really be good together. Yes, I'm looking for that here. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Usually I like to get to know the person before going down on them, but, <laughs> you know. Fuck. Ruben, you're not looking to be her casual D? Nope. What's your name? Ruben. Ruben? Mm -hmm. Leandra, nice oh, to meet you. Nice. Ruben, boy, come on, dog. Be the casual. Leandra, nice oh, to meet nice you. Level. Thank you. What's a dating ick that bothers you? This is kind of mean, and I know that some. Dating other Asians. That some people are just not athletic, but like, I brought someone to play volleyball with us, and he was so bad, and it. Like, as an Asian dating other Asians, you know what I mean? Because apparently, like, Asians are racist to other Asians type of vibe, you know? But yeah, that's very racist, so I take that back. I do apologize for other people. Don't be like that. It was, like, <laughs> such an ick. But I think the ick more came from, like, he thought he was going to be really good. That was and funny, he still though. thought he was really good <laughs> afterwards, and I was like, you uh, were so yeah. bad. <laughs> what are your dating icks? Not being committed to, like, just being on time. And, like, if, you know, you're not interested in someone, you can... You know, I think you're so great. I just mm -hmm. am not sure there's like a romantic connection there. Understandable. Nice to meet you, Ruben. Nice to meet you too. What was it that made you press me? I would say there wasn't a lot of physical attraction. It's probably the Asian thing. She's gonna lie though and say, ooh, what, 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 it's the Asian thing. Action there, which is maybe a little <laughs> shallow, but I'm Leandra. Sterling. Sterling? 
Pleasure. Nice to meet you. I love Lady your mustache. Andrea. It's like in I a post so. Top Gun world. <laughs> it's Top like Gun. the ladies love a mustache. <laughs> <laughs> well, I had it before the new Top Gun came out, so. Okay, so you were you were before the trend. Yeah, it's been like four an OG years. mustache. OG mustache. Okay, yeah. okay. Can you two take turns talking about your dating history? You go first. My dating history, I've been in two serious relationships. One was like throughout college and yeah, it just like didn't work, which is great because we were like really actually not compatible. I actually got dumped by someone who I actually really liked and could yeah. have potentially seen it like getting more serious. But it was, yeah, a couple Sundays ago. A couple Sundays ago from now? Yeah. Okay, so you're like, like two weeks fresh, ago. you're fresh off well, this. Well, yeah. <laughs> and uh, it's still in the back of my head. I'm like, damn, I like them. And, like, yeah. It sucks. Like, they put in so much more than like I like, yeah. was wanting to put in. And that seems to be kind of a common thing in a lot of my relationships. I think. There I feel like you would have been perfect for the previous girl, for the casual chick girl, because obviously she wants casual dick, and then he doesn't seem like he's, you know, ready for commitment and stuff. You know, which usually that's the case. If you want casual dick, you get someone that is sort of, you know not really looking or not wanting a serious thing so and she looks like she's ready to fucking get married bro she looks like she wants to get married today like have five kids you know what i mean type of Brand understandings of like what expectations were and everything oh sorry i called oh. it i know sorry i pressed it twice that felt like extra savage especially two weeks my guy you need to let that brew a little <laughs> you don't need to be here on the button <laughs> hey, i'm just here for a good time yeah not a long time but a good time Shoo. you are like very very attractive oh, he's back. you know okay. that um, yeah? I don't, I don't know, like, that sounds cocky as hell. Yeah, but, like, like, it's okay. It's cool. You can know Shout that Shout out to are. my mom. Yeah, you know I will. I'll let her know after Absolutely. this. Absolutely. Oh, my God, I love that. <laughs> okay. Do you find Leandro attractive? I do. Thank I you. do, actually, yeah. I like <laughs> actually. It. And I like, wait, no, no, for real. Like, yeah, yeah. You know, some people try to be polite, but yeah. I'm being totally honest, and I like the fit. Thank I you. Like David, are you a Republican? <laughs> I am not a Republican. <laughs> Are you a Republican? Great. I am not. That oh, was one of okay. my deal breakers. Oh, so. okay, okay, yeah. Thank goodness you um, passed that I'm test. I'm not a Republican. Okay, great. Did I, did I give that vibe, but it's kind of crazy. A little bit. <laughs> you, don't give, you don't give me a Republican okay, vibe, good. David. I'm don't a little worry. hurt about that. Yeah, but yeah. no. But no, I'm not a Republican. Okay, that's great. That's so, great. Yeah. What are other character traits about yourself that like uh, your friends would say? I'm competitive. Let's uh, freaking go. They might say I'm argumentative, but I don't think that's, that's yeah. what it is. No, I think it's just like, I like... I think it's a great it's a great um, thing to have as well. Maybe not in a relationship, because relationships sometimes need you to be to have like a balance, you know, which is I guess something that me, you know, and my current and my partner like sort of like uh, is that we're both very competitive, you know. But yeah, it's it's really great to be competitive, but sometimes in a relationship it sucks because it's like you, you almost always want to be right type of vibe, you know. Choose your battles. Your Having friends. a good convo, but yeah. like, I want to make sure you're talking about what you know. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, so. that's fair. I've been really into pickleball lately. Do I you play a, sports? Okay. Yeah, I played football in high school, okay. and then like once football was done senior year, did tennis. Oh, so you're like, you you have the pickleball blood in you. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. And then in college, I lived with like three girls. They look good together, I must say. They look good together. I feel like there might be a good vibe, you know. Plus, blacks and Asians, you know. Um, Oh, it's like a really great vibe. Um, I feel like I'm going to get canceled. Listen, if I do get canceled after doing this, I, I don't mind and I understand, you know, because somehow I don't know why, but it's almost turning into like a racial thing, you know, um, and I don't know why, but yeah, Asians and black people make cute babies, man. Fuck the bullshit. Volleyball club wow. team or whatever. So like I've been to practices. What's so the deal with you just living with three girls? I grew up with women. Like so I grew up with my mom and my grandma. Okay. So it's like it's way easier. It's yeah. a little bit more cleaner. That's like, fast. Like the the public areas that we have to share are cleaner. Yeah. Okay. So then you're clean too. Yes. I'm feeling like there's a connection here. Is this a match? Are you feeling each other? I am. I'm feeling David I am. for sure. I'm feeling you. I'm gonna light up one more time, just okay. to be sure. Okay. All right. I like bowling a lot. Let's go. I like go. going bowling. You like going bowling? I love bowling, but I get crap for it all the time. Uh -huh. I, for my birthday a couple years ago, wanted to do bowling, like invite a bunch of friends bowling. And yeah. She's talking shit. I don't know why, but I just feel like she's talking shit. She's doing that thing when you meet someone that you really like, 
and then you just like you know you're gonna like everything they like but you might not be actually really that into that thing you know but because you like this person you're willing to sort of like do it you know what i mean so yeah chill out they like were like you can't do that that's, that's really wild. but i get it like i get it like i get it like she she likes him you know embarrassing that's what i did last she's year trying, she's trying to make an effort Wow. So that's kind of crazy. Congratulations. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yay! Yeah. Oh, Can go. I give you a hug? Yeah, absolutely. Let's go. Okay? Yeah. Wow, it's so nice kisses. to meet you. Just do kisses. Go to Target. There you go. So yeah, man, that's the end of the show, of course, or the end of the reaction. Thank you very much for watching. Um, it's been amazing. Shout out to The Cut as well, man. They're doing amazing work, you know. Um, and like I said in the beginning, please don't fucking strike our video, you know what I mean? Please let us like react to them, you know, but um, if you do get striked, you'll know why. Or if you don't see it anymore after the first time, you'll know why. So yeah, shout out to them, man, and shout out to the content. Really amazing stuff. Peace. I'll see you on the next one.